Hello class! Welcome to our channel! This is Alan Shane at your service. Thank you so much class for choosing Alan Shane's tutorial for you to be able to know more about accounting. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share to your loved ones. So now, let's discuss about the topic of what is a statement of changes in owner's equity. So, what is the statement of changes in owner's equity? But before that, in our previous videos, we already discussed those financial statements, what, I, what is the balance sheet or the statement of financial position, what is an income statement or the statement of comprehensive income. And in this video, we will discuss about statement of changes in owner's equity. When we say statement of changes in owner's equity, it is what? It is, okay, when we say statement of changes in owner's equity, it is a statement that what? Summarizes, summarizes the changes, summarizes the changes in equity for what for a given period of time so when we say statement of changes in owner's equity it summarizes the changes in equity for a given period of time so we have this the beginning owner is increased for what additional profit or or additional investment or profit. So, in this statement of changes in owner's equity, if there is an additional investment and profit, or additional investment and profit, so, the beginning equity will increase. So, it will increase the beginning equity. But if there is a withdrawal or loss, it will what? It will decrease the beginning equity. So it will decrease the beginning equity. If additional investment in profit will increase, so it I if there is an additional investment in profit, so it will increase the beginning equity. But if there is a withdrawal or, lo or loss, it will decrease. Okay, so now, because we already know what is the statement of changes in equity, we will now proceed to the example of the statement of changes in owner's equity. So, here, this is an example of the changes or statement of changes in owner's equity. So, Allen Shane Auto Repair Shop, it is the title or the name of the business. So, it is the name of the business. So, don't forget the name of the business, Gida, because there are a lot of statement of changes in owner's equity. Para ma-identify that this statement is for the is for Allen Shane's Auto Repair Shop. Then, the statement of changes in owner's equity, it is called the title of the report. Next, for the month ended January 31, 2022, it is called the period covered by the report. Okay, ulit ha. When we say Allen Chain Auto Repair Shop, it is called the name of the business, statement of changes in owner's equity, title of the report, and for the month and the January 31, 2022, so the period covered by the report. So here, first, 
account is the AS Cabanyo Capital. So, the total of 800,000, di ba? According to our explanation a while ago, di ba? If there is a profit for the month, it will what? It will increase the beginning capital. So, therefore, we have to add the 85,020 from the beginning equity. From the beginning equity of 800,000. So, the total is 885,020. Then, diba, if there is a withdrawal, so withdrawal, we have to decrease the beginning equity. So, therefore, 885,020 less the withdrawal of 12,000 is equal to 800, excuse me, 73,020 or 873,020. Okay, ha, ulit. Um, the correct answer is 873,020. So, gi-correct ko ha, 873,020. Okay, next. So, in this example, the amount of the increase from the equity or owner's equity beginning is how much? So, if we will compute the increase... So, we have to, um, this uh, owner's equity, owner's equity and, so how much is the owner's equity and? 873,020 less what? The owner's equity beginning. So, how much? 800,000. So, therefore, the increase in owner's equity is how much? 73,020. So, 873,000 less 800,000. So, the increase in owner's equity is 73,020. Next, we will also compute for the net increase in owner's equity. So, in order for us to compute the net increase, we have to first identify the what? Profit for the month. So, how much is the profit for the month? So, the profit is 85,020 less what less the withdrawal so how much is the withdrawal 12000 so now so 85020 minus 12000 is equal to 73020 so the uh, net increase Net increase in owner's equity is 73,020. Okay? So, nakuha. So, ulit. When we say statement of changes in owner's equity, it summarizes the changes in equity for a given period of time. So, when there is an additional investment and at the same time profit, so it will increase the beginning equity. But if there is a withdrawal or loss, it will decrease the beginning equity. Now, let's go to the example of the uh, statement of changes in owner's equity. So, Allen Shane Auto Repair Shop, it, this is the name of the business, do not forget this one. Statement of changes in owner's equity, title of the report. For the month ended January 31, 2022, the period covered by the report. So, the first is the beginning equity. So, the first account, AS Capital, January 1, because it is beginning, 800,000. Add profit, 85,020. So, the total is 885,020 less. Diba? If there is a withdrawal, we have to deduct or decrease. So, 12,000. So, the AS Capital... AS Capital end is 873,020.
20. Okay. Next is, in, we have to calculate the increase in owner's equity. So, in order for us to get the increase in owner's equity, we have to first get the owner's equity and which is 100. 73,020 less the owner's equity of 800,000. So, the increase in owner's equity is 73,020. Then, in order for us to get the net increase in owner's equity, so, we have to get the profit for the month, 85,020 less withdrawal of 12,000. So, net increase in owner's equity is 73,020. So, that's it for our discussion for today. Hope you learned something. Thank you so much, class. And don't forget to subscribe our YouTube channel. And also, you can uh, have comment below if you have any topics that you wanted to be discussed in our future videos. Thank you so much, class. God bless. Don't forget to share our video.